Well, for months, we've been telling you about the economic decline that has affected hundreds of thousands of Idahoans, leading to record high unemployment and food insecurity all over our states. A hunger free Idaho. That's the mission the Idaho Food Bank is hoping to accomplish each year and to gauge their progress. The Food Bank refers to an annual report called Map the Meal Gap. Frankie Catafias joins us live with a little bit more about those results. Frankie, good morning. Matt, good morning. When I spoke to Karen Valk, who's the president and CEO of the Idaho Food Bank, she told me there's some good news. And then there's some scary news regarding food insecurity here in Idaho. Numbers from this past fiscal year show that food insecurity was low. Idaho was actually at the lowest point since before the Great Recession. However, COVID-19 and high unemployment rates could drastically alter those results for the worst. And unfortunately, the food bank is feeling an immediate impact financially. We look at our last fiscal year. For the whole year, we spent $200,000 um, to purchase food. In the last three months, we've already spent $900,000. The food bank provides nutritious foods to those in need. And unfortunately, in today's climate, donations are scarce and nutritious food isn't always cheap. Coming up a little bit later in our next half hour, I'll be talking to you about the food bank's projections for this upcoming year and how they plan to stay afloat. Matt.